All right, welcome back to the final reaction. Nick here, and now I'm super excited to check out the Transformers newest trailer. You can see right here, if you can, my Beast Wars um, toys. These are not original vintage. I've had uh, my wife, believe it or not, buy these for me for Christmas the last few years. I was such a huge Beast Wars fan as a kid. I was a much bigger fan of the Beast Wars than the Transformers. The Transformers, I liked it, loved it. The, the animated movie came out when I was just a few years old. Beast Wars came out when I was, you know, 9, 10, 11, 12. And even though the animation was really, really wonky, the toys were fantastic. I still liked this show. And I'm really excited that they are incorporating this in the Transformers world. Now, Transformers, oh my gosh, this franchise started off so hot for me. Loved it. The second and third one was more of, more of a disappointment each time, but I still enjoyed those two. Especially, uh, I like Shia LaBeouf's character, John Totoro, the, the Transformers themselves. But that first one, for me, is like Oscar-worthy. Not really, but really, really good compared to the other ones. And then the sequels, Age of Extinction, you know, I, I liked half of it. The other half, I could care less about it. But then The Last Night happened. And I tell people all the time, The Last Night is the worst movie experience I've ever had in my entire life. It was the most boring movie. It was the worst movie I've ever seen in a theater, even though it had Sir Anthony Hopkins in it. Absolutely pointless and dumb movie. And you have this joker, I can't remember what his name is, from like San Francisco Chronicle or something like that, talking about how Black Adam's the worst movie of all time. He obviously has not seen The Last Night. He obviously avoided that like the plague when everyone else was trashing it because that was garbage. Then Bumblebee came out, and I wasn't as high on it as so many other critics who were super excited about it. I did enjoy it, but I've never felt the need to watch it again, if that says anything. And so I'm not sure which one we're on right now. I think there's another Transformers I'm missing. I don't know. But it says right here, Transformers 7. 7 for crying out loud. Jeez Louise, I thought there was only 5. Oh, did I say? No, I said 6. Yeah, so 7. So that makes sense. Rise of the Beasts. That's funny because this one that says Rise of the Beats. If you're going to put the trailer, you got to get the name correct. Rise of the Beasts. Again, you got these awesome Beast War characters. And I, I can't tell you what the names of them are because it's been too long. Who do I have right here? I have, okay, just Megatron. So it's the same name like Optimus Prime, but they're in animal form. See, I don't even remember that. I just remember loving it. And when I saw these toys, you can see right there on clearance, 40 bucks. When I saw these toys the last few years, I told my wife, you got to get them for me. I think I asked for another one this year. I have no idea what else is available. But the toys were awesome. The show was awesome. I'm excited for this movie. If you're excited for my trailer reaction, if you like anything about what I say, if you're also a Beast Wars kid, give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Check out some other videos we have here on the channel. Just reacted to Indiana Jones 5 trailer and Guardians of the Galaxy 3 trailer. They're both on the channel right now. Enjoy yourself a few reactions. And I appreciate the views, appreciate the clicks, and I really appreciate the subscription if you did so. But let's go ahead and check this out. John Campia said this was really good, and so that's good enough for moi. I'm going to go ahead and check it out, um, not just because he said so, but I'm going to react to it because he said so, because he definitely knows what he's talking about. I want to make sure I get the right video to react to. This looks like the right one. At least it's spelled correctly. And here we go. Millions of years, 65 million years. One to fear, Prime. There is a darkness coming. Prime versus Prime. Bumblebee! Okay. I swear it's not me! Oh! Oh, okay. Oh, that's jacked up. That looks awesome. Yes! A 
of all the threats. From both your past and future. You've never faced anything like this. Let them come. Cheetah! Oh, I love the Beast logo. Let's get real. Let's get real. Oh, <laughs> oh, like a G. Okay. I mean, I'm just saying. It looks really, really good. John Campion was not a liar. When does he ever lie? He's always correct. Always correct. Um, didn't get to see Megatron and the T-Rex or whatever, but that's okay. Didn't get to see a lot about what this movie's really going to be about. Just a lot of action, transforming. I mean, that's really all you need to get psyched up. So I really can't get too excited because I don't know too much about what it's going to be about. But this is just a trailer. It should be a teaser, really. Comes out in June, summertime of 2023. I'm already going to be there first day and watch this. Will it be first day? Maybe second or third day, but I'll be there that first weekend for sure. Just because of the Beast Wars aspects. I'm telling you, if you were to watch these shows now, you probably wouldn't be able to get through the entire thing because it had like that 90s, like 3D, all is that computer graphics or whatever. It looks really, it looks bad at the time, the whole holographic look or whatever. It looked bad at the time, but the adventures were great. The characters were great, and they just looked cool as animals. Um, as simple as that. Let's take Beast Wars animals. I just ate it up, and I'm going to eat this movie up all, all day long and all weekend long and whatever. Maybe eat up popcorn, not the movie, and watch the movie. But this trailer, it's got me excited for it. Now, even though I've seen all the movies... I'm already lost now because Bumblebee was a prequel. I'm lost in like what happened in last night because it was so hard to follow that garbage. Uh, I think there was like Merlin was involved in some. I mean, I don't know what's happening there. But excited for this one. Let's stay on task. Let's stay on track. Let me know what you think about it. Don't forget to like and subscribe. We'd really appreciate that. And until next time, adios.